participation. And you have also listened to discussions in the seminar room for the last four days. This IMC session has been quite different from what we have seen in the last two years. It has taken recourse to showcasing applications now. And uh, these, these applications are mainly the next gen applications which will run either on 5G or aggregate other applications so that uh, we now start moving towards utilizing what we have rolled out as a 5G network. So that's a very hard thing thing. We also saw large scale participation of uh, startups and these startups you could see eagerness on their faces, you could see the products were world class and uh, the other highlight was that we had a lot of foreign visitors during this IMC basically because of the other conference which is going on next door but uh, uh, they generated a lot of interest among the foreigners also. At the end of the day the discussions which took place in the sessions both you know, class apart this time and there was a huge amount of attendance and question and answer sessions and knowledge dissipation was really good and a lot of lessons have been learned. Overall it was a very good experience and we hope to gain from this to go into next year with renewed energy. Thank you. Okay, so now I'm here at Airtel Sol and today with me is Rahul sir. sir. How do you feel about IMC 2024? I think the IMC's theme this time was future is here, future is now. What you see at the Airtel Arena is our theme, which is what, uh, which is future in motion, right? We really feel that with the technology is powering on, with AI coming in, we are actually able to now actualize a lot of the vision which we had earlier in serving and being customer obsessed. We have got fantastic products out here on governance, on security, on spam, for example, on connectivity showing Leo and our sustainability products. Come out to Intel Arena and experience the future in motion. Okay, thank you so much, Rahul. So finally, I'm here at Vodafone stall, and today with me is Anjali Ma'am. Anjali Ma'am, how are you doing? Thank you so much. So, how do you feel about IMC 2024, Ma'am? This, I think, every time I think it can't get better, and it does. It continues to buzz, and I think specifically, I would like to talk about. Wonderful idea this time. The booth is absolutely rocking. We have some very engaging and interactive use cases, and which have been really good crowd pullers. We've had uh, things like Dwarka Darshan, which gives us the immersive experience. We've had Game to Fame, which is like a sports uh, uh, challenge that we are running. We have live music orchestra. On the business side, uh, we also have a Healthcare of Bharat Initiative which is giving primary healthcare in a bag to remote villages. So it's absolutely like real-time diagnostics, that's a big one. We also have a demonstration of uh, MSMEs, you know, for Bharat, and uh, we are giving them a free digital advisory service. So that again is something which is aligned with the government objective. Uh, we are demonstrating industry 4.2 with our smart mining uh, use case, which covers a whole range of uh, smart solutions that can be used by the industry. So all in all, I think we've had an absolutely wonderful experience this time and uh, look forward to the next one. Thank, Thank you so you. much. And ma'am, we all know Vodafone has given a splendid show this time. I must say the rock concert was amazing and Dr. Darshan, as we had mentioned, is amazing. And that uh, we just saw an AI generated that for the, uh, for the dental and yes. for the eyes. Yes. That was such yes. an amazing and that's a new vision. So. so it's the power of technology and I should not probably leave out my CSR initiatives. You know, last time we had smart agriculture and uh, financial literacy. This time we're showcasing uh, a Rudy Ben initiative which started in Gujarat. It is creating micro women entrepreneurs who are, uh, you know, adding to their income. They are using a solution, an app, which has been, been designed by Vodafone Idea yes. to increase their sales in the market. We have the scholarship tree. We do curated scholarships as well as give out scholarships you know, to deserving students. So, all in all, I think it's a very comprehensive, uh, you know, demonstration of the power of technology, technology for good and the future is life. Thank you. Thank you so much, Anjali. Here I am at the HFC 
Seal stall and today with me is Harshwatan Pagai sir. Harshwatan sir, very nice to meet you. Yeah. So, how are you feeling about the IMC 2024 sir? Yeah, so IMC is a very good platform to showcase our products and uh, every time in IMC we are coming out with some launches. So, this time we have not launched any product in OFC but we have launched some UBR products and that was done uh, on the first day itself. And I feel it is a very good platform to show whatever we have done, whatever innovation we have done. For example, you can see on this wall, uh, we have all the data center cables, so which is picking up in India now. And uh, we have different variants uh, on the high fiber count cables with the latest technology, which is called IDEA, Intermittently Bonded Ribbon Cable. Uh, we have uh, from starting from 144 to 1728 fiber. And now we are developing 34, 56 and 6912 fiber cable also, uh, which will be used by all the hyperscalers like AWS, Microsoft, Google, etc. So, I mean, it's a great platform and uh, we interact with all the telecom operators, all our customers here under one roof. So, it's nice and we participate every year. So, it seems like HFCL is already contributing to Modiji's dream of Bharat. So, that is wonderful. So, you look forward to the next IMC season all coming up? Yes, yes, of course, of course. We, we have been participating since the first IMC mm -hmm. and uh, we will continue participating in the future also. All right, look, thank you so much, Ashwadan sir. Looking forward to again seeing you. Thank you so much. Today I am at the stall of Fortinet and today with me is Venusa. Venusa, nice to meet you. Hi. So how are you feeling about IMC 2024, sir? This time I think IMC has been in a different league altogether. Mm -hmm. Now we have been matching with the other countries mm -hmm. where we are hosting the uh, telecom partners. I think IMC has taken a greater league on this. Right, sir. That's wonderful. So, being a front frontrunner in the cyber security, yeah. so do you look forward to something more and more interesting for the next IMC 2025 or in the next coming year? Yeah. So, this time we have come up with new products, uh, new solutions, and obviously next time we are going to be there uh, more bigger than this. Perfect. Thank you, sir. Very, very good evening. How are you doing? Sir, how are you finding IMC 2024, sir? Oh, it has been an enlightening experience. It's a much bigger and better organization than the last six or seven IMCs. There are a lot of international companies participating, but the most important factor is a lot of Indian companies who have showcased indigenously designed and indigenously manufactured. That's a pride for us, and that is following up the vision of Honorable Prime Minister of Bharat. And moreover, when you see international companies and Indian companies converging at the same place, good exchange of technological information takes place. Moreover, the 6G alliance, and what India is trying to do on 6G, where India wants to lead the world in standardization in 6G, this uh, uh, symposium would be a good big way to help Indian companies to work higher efficiency and standardization of 6G products. Uh, thank you so much, sir. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you. Hi, so now I am at the Telcom stall and today here with me is Mr. Sumit Goswami. Sumit sir, how are you doing? I am doing pretty good. Sir, how do you feel about IMC 2024 sir? It is extremely good, extremely well organized. India never had a very big scale trade shows and IMC shows that how it can be when all the companies come together. So feeling great. As an Indian, I feel proud that so many of new ideas coming in, whether for big MNCs, small startups, all come together showcasing their products, innovations, everything, creating a platform for networking. That comes with a maximum satisfaction. Great job, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. Looking forward to So here today I am at Minister of Development of Northeastern Region stall, and today here with me is Anand sir. Anand sir, very Hi. welcome. How are you doing, sir? So, sir, how do you feel about IMC 2024? IMC has been always a great platform to interact with customers from different parts of the country to get fresh perspective over the latest technologies in the field. It's always a platform which gives us a point to give and share. We know a lot of things and the lessons learned we deploy in the field. Right. We, look, we were here in 23rd, we are here in 24, we'll also come back in 25. We're looking forward to having you, Anand. Thank you so much. And today here with me is Mr. Mayankar Kambayan, sir. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Great to hear, sir. How, how do you find IMC 2024 this year, sir? Oh, wow. This is this is much bigger, much greater than uh, last year, I would say. I think uh, uh, with foreign delegates coming from ITU, WTSA also is 
impacting a lot. So you know, lots of people coming from different countries. That that is helping a lot. So and crowd from academia is uh, huge. Uh, and uh, another thing is the innovation that uh, the startups are bringing in, and that our our company, the other companies are bringing in, not just from the perspective of uh, the network, but also from consumer, uh, the villagers, and the enterprise, all coming together. It's really good. Great to hear from you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hi, so I am now at Coal India's stall, and for the first time, I am meeting Dr. Tariq Sajjad, sir. Namaskar, how are you, sir? Very fine. So, how how are you finding IMC 2024, sir? Yeah. So definitely, uh, Mr. Deepak Prakash, this uh, 2024 IMC is uh, very very much effective and uh, efficiently and. Uh, or especially for coal industry because we participated in last year also. So last year, in compared to last year, this year, we are, last year we have 139 square meter, but this time we have 136 square meter and we got a very uh, prime location of this stall. And uh, in this, the technology demonstration, especially for the 5, 5G use cases, we are having the 13 5G use cases and we belong to from CMPDI, Central Mines Planning and Design Institute, which is a subsidiary of Coal India Limited. And definitely in the CMPDI we, uh, with the uh, technical uh, collaboration with uh, Tidal Wave, we have demonstrated here 13 use cases which is very very much pertinent for the coal uh, industry and also this is the 5G use. We have a drone first time uh, we have demonstrated and it is going to be used in mines. So uh, this IMC 22 has given a very good platform. I am really thankful to IMC 2024 that they have given the very, the very golden opportunity and very big opportunity so that this uh, uh, program is now very much successful. And definitely our chairman, Cool India, on 15th came, we inaugurated our CMD from G came and they were all very, very much satisfied. And I hope that in future also in, in IMC 25, it will much more better. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.